Hey y'all, it's Paige Duke and I'm one of your on-air hosts for Ride TV. I currently host a show called Southern Fried Skinny Fied, my cooking show, and here's a sneak peek at my new cookbook. Ever since I was a little girl, I've always loved horses and I, I wanted to get involved in riding, but my family wasn't involved in the horse industry at all. My grandmother was the one in the family who liked to ride horses. She had a few trail horses and then some pasture ornaments and she knew how much I loved it, so she decided to put us both in riding lessons, I think when I was five years old. I was always out at my grandmother's house. Every weekend, every time I'd get out of school, I'd go out there and I'd work with my horses, and then she'd always have a glass of sweet tea and some homemade bread for me when I was done. So she got me in these lessons, and I started doing kind of hunter, under saddle type riding, and I absolutely loved it. And it really did deepen our bond. Still to this day, I don't remember ever getting as excited for anything else like I did for a horse show. You know, that morning it'd be freezing cold, I'd be up before the sun was up. I was just so excited. And my dad would get me ready and he'd take me up to the barn and um, we'd bathe the horse and braid his mane and tail and just make him look nice. And I just absolutely loved it. Fell in love with horse riding. Well then, get a little older and I started wanting to be a cowgirl. So I decided I wanted to start riding western. Then I was given a horse that was at my grandma's named Banjo. A guy named Wild Man had raised him and he gave him to me. And he was an awesome horse. He was just broke, safe, would do anything you asked of him. And he was like the perfect best friend for me at the time. And so I would take him over cross rails, I'd go trail riding with him. Then I decided I was gonna barrel race on him, but he would do all of it for me. Went to Clemson, I majored in animal science, and equine business was my concentration, so I was almost always at the horse barn. My mom and dad would come up to Clemson on the weekends and watch me ride, and if I was in a rodeo, they'd come up there, so it really was a great way to bring my family back together, to watch me ride and then enjoy our time together. I fully intend on raising kids around horses, if I have them. <laughs> I haven't decided yet. I'm much better with animals than I am kids. It's such an awesome thing to be involved in, and it teaches you um, so many different things that other sports maybe don't teach you. It teaches you um, partnership and it, compassion for animals. Horses teach you something every time you get on them. So it's really cool to have a, an understanding with your horse and a partnership and a friendship to where you walk out in the pasture and they're coming straight up to you. Like it's, it's an amazing feeling when your horse loves you and wants to be with you.